the 21st century we have entered the urban age. How we will live in the future, how we will work in the future. These are decisive questions when world population is growing so fast, as somebody said, up to 10 billion by 2050. The JPI Urban Europe is a transnational research innovation program of almost 20 European member states collaborating, trying to, to align their research and, and innovation programs to provide answers for most pressing questions of the future. central questions for the future of our cities and for the people who live there. So we strive for better quality of life in urban areas and enhanced welfare for all citizens in sustainable and inclusive cities. But urban areas across Europe show different dynamics and challenges. We reflect on that in all our efforts. Our strategic research and innovation agenda combines an ambitious longitudinal program focused on sustainable urban transitions with the transverse program addressing five related urban challenges. Vibrancy in Changing Economies aims to understand how urban economies can be made more competitive and more resilient to market fluctuations, how income equality can be improved upon and how opportunities for today's youth can best be fostered. I think it's something really important to maintain and hopefully the cities will continue to promote diversity of, of you know, socioeconomic and cultural diversity over just being built for the wealthy, really. Yeah. Uh, de vivir en mi ciudad, de que no hay trabajo y el trabajo que hay no está suficientemente, no tiene la suficiente calidad. Driven by post-2008 austerity measures, civic services and the size of the welfare state are reducing, as big society is being increasingly called upon to fill the void through bottom-up voluntary efforts. So the theme Welfare and Finance will investigate how these grassroots endeavours can improve public services and urban spaces, and which business models are most effective. I need uh, um the possibilities to meet with other people. I need a resource efficient city and I need an including city, which also looks into the social sustainability parts. Urban environmental sustainability and resilience addresses the need to significantly reduce greenhouse gas emissions and to improve the resilience and adaptive capacity of our cities in response to climate change. Ich hab's gern, wenn's nicht so von Kettenunternehmen boomt, daher wohne ich ganz gern in den Rändern der Städte, um, wo es auch mehr Grünflächen gibt. An indoor place where people can go meet, I would say a big place where there's chairs and people can just go there. Accessibility and connectivity focuses on improved accessibility to infrastructure, services and urban amenities, and the connectivity between them. Here, we're really interested in how journeys can be made more seamless and better informed, and how services for the more vulnerable members of society, the elderly, the physically impaired and the unemployed, can be improved upon. I think we have to have a new view on how we treat transportation and urban environments in the future, that we have to question whether we, how much uh, space we, we give for cars and how much space we give for people. The walkable city is the city of, of the future, really. Successful sustainable transition pathways will need the engagement of all urban stakeholders, from public and private organizations to individual citizens. So new forms of urban governance and participation are needed. New frameworks supporting co-creation among stakeholders that unlock their full creative potential, as well as the potential to utilize big data and new enabling technologies. I'm very interested in how we create ideas together and how we involve that everybody feels they are invited into the, to the discussion. Addressing these interrelated urban challenges requires a joined up approach in which academic experts from different disciplines work together with non-academic experts and stakeholders. We as a community need to work together. 
let's connect. The people in the cities have quite different needs. However, we have to address common questions how to improve the quality of life and sustainability in our European cities and to establish them as attractive places to live, work and enjoy. I would build jazz clubs all over town. <laughs> so we would have gigs all the time. Yeah, that's awesome. That would be awesome. <laughs>